spring. I know no, you're like just jabbing. Jabbing. By the way, those Overnight, a fiery face-off between two top governors with presidential overtones. He's joined at the hip with Biden and Harris. You're nothing but a bully. Florida's Republican Governor Ron DeSantis, who's running for the GOP nomination in 2024, taking on California's Democratic Governor Gavin Newsom, who's backing President Biden's re-election. There were fireworks from the start when DeSantis sharply criticized Newsom for visiting a fancy French restaurant at the height of the COVID pandemic. He's imposed restrictions on his own people while exempting himself from those restrictions and going to the French laundry while his people were suffering. The governors clashed over border security. Newsom criticizing DeSantis's controversial move last year, sending migrants to Martha's Vineyard. You're trolling folks and trying to find migrants to play political games, to try to get some news and attention so you can out Trump Trump. And by the way, how's that going for you, Ron? You're down 41 points in your own home state. DeSantis firing back, accusing Newsom of being soft on border security. This is the vision of Biden, Harris, Newsom, open borders. But it was the issue of abortion that prompted some of the sharpest exchanges. Newsom slamming DeSantis for signing a six-week abortion ban into law in Florida. Before women even know they're pregnant, Ron, even Donald Trump said it was too extreme. Well, I believe in a culture of life. The biggest question of the night, the political future of both men. Terms. Why don't you right, admit gentlemen. that you're running? Hold on. Hannity pressing Newsom on whether he would replace President Biden on the ticket if asked. It's not even it's not even optional. He's doing fantastically. He says Joe Biden is 100 percent up to the job. You know that that's not true. So, Kristen, let's talk about this. Uh, what was the point of that debate in the first place? Great question, Hoda. Look, Governor DeSantis has struggled to stand out of the packed field in the latest debates, but with the Iowa caucuses just over a month away now and his opponent Nikki Haley surging, a one-on-one -on -one debate presented him a real opportunity to potentially reinvigorate his campaign, taking on one of the most high-profile Democratic governors and showing GOP voters what kind of a general election candidate he'd be. This also served as a chance for Newsom to assert himself on the national stage beyond California and establish himself as one of President Biden's campaign's main surrogates, despite all of the buzz about a potential run. But make no mistake, he's already getting plenty of buzz for the future. All right, Hoda. Kristen, thank you so much. We're going to actually see you Sunday morning on Meet the Press. You will be talking to Governor DeSantis. Hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific, on our streaming channel, Today All Day. To watch, head to today.com slash all day or click the link right here.